Hi everyone, this is Rudy. He's a pig that we just recently got. And this week our video is about how we potty train Rudy. So that way Rudy is in the house and not making a mess anywhere. To begin, we bought a little dog pen from Royal King, a four by four foot one. We opened it, put it together, and put it on a four foot piece of wood that I had at the house. Shot some holes around the edges. And then we could take some zip ties through that hole and tie the fence down. This is what it should look like. And now the next part is actually building a frame. To build a frame, we started at Lowe's. Got two two by fours that were 96 inches long, which is eight feet. We cut that down into four boards. Two of the boards we had 45 inches long. We're gonna call that board A. And then the other two boards were 48 inches long. We're gonna call those boards B. Then we set these out into a frame. We put boards B on top and boards A in between boards B. It's gonna end up being four feet on every side. Once you have your frame built, you're gonna put your tarp on top of it and start fastening the sides. Make sure pull it tight in these corners so I do it like this, where you kind of do one and fold it over. I want everything to be nice and flush. Go ahead and cut off any of the extra that you have. That way the pig doesn't chew on it, make much noise. Once done, we put it right there into our little pig room. Refasten our sides so that way the pig can't move the fence up. And we took a little bit of wood shavings, put them down over here so that way the pig knows where to use the restroom at. Now that part's done, we're gonna go ahead and do part two where we actually train the pig. So we let him into his room, we give him some snacks, that way he sees it as a positive thing. And then we're gonna keep him in his room for two or three days. This forces him to use the restroom and he's going to choose a corner of his room. And once that begins, he's going to try to keep using that. Now it's time to let him out. When you do, make sure you only let him out for a couple hours at a time. Keep a really good eye on him. And if he does use the restroom where he's not supposed to, reinforce that, smack him on the nose and put him right back into that pen. After all of this, you should have a potty trained little piggy at home. And that there's some really great benefits to that. Having a potty trained pig, you're gonna have an animal that's not gonna jump up on the couch, um, not gonna get hair everywhere. There's a little more independent, so I can put them in this pen if I have to and leave them for a day. And they're not going to make any type of mess anywhere in my house. Um, and if I ever have extra food scraps, I can just give it to him. He, he'll eat whatever I give him. Next week, we're going to do another video about something else. So follow along. We, this is what we do. We do little odd projects every, every week.